The color review today is Sherwin-Williams Whirly Gray, and this gray paint color is considered a chameleon, and a lot of people don't realize this until it's too late, and I'm gonna show you why. For those of you out there that have been following me for a while will know that I will never call this paint color a warm or a cool paint color without comparing it to other colors, and I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about later on in this video, and I'm gonna show you what this paint color looks like in both the north and south facing rooms and why this matters. The first thing you need to know about Whirly Gray are these undertones. This is a complex gray. It's got a personality of its own and I want you to watch carefully as I explain it to you because later on in this video, I'm gonna talk about lighting and then you're gonna understand why this paint color is called a chameleon. Right here is Whirly Gray. Now all by itself, it's not gonna do you any justice. We've got to compare it with other paint colors to get a better idea of what this color could look like in your home. So watch this. When I compare this with Horizon, look what just happened. You see the violet undertones. However, when I compare this with Stone Herb, look what just happened. You see the blue undertones, and in certain situations, you will see a little bit of a pink undertone. So, for all of you out there that are thinking about painting this color in your home, you need to make sure that you have the right lighting, the right interior decor, and you need to be sure that it pairs perfectly with both your fixed and furnished elements that you may have in your home. If you don't do this right, it could either make or break the flow of your home. Next, I'm gonna show you why I don't call this paint color either a warm or a cool color. By the way, if you're new to this channel, feel free to subscribe. I give you valuable information just like you're seeing right here in this video. You can never say any neutral paint color is either a warm or a cool paint color without comparing it to other colors. And the best way to explain it is to show you. Watch what happens when I compare Whirly Gray to other colors. Right here is a new gray. Look what just happened. Whirly Gray is lighter than a new gray. Now, when I compare this with Gray Al, notice how Whirly Gray is warmer than Gray Al. So now you know why I would never consider Whirly Gray to be either a warm or a cool paint color without comparing it to other colors. And this refers to any color that you may have in both your interior decor and fixed elements that you have in your home. Now, it's one thing to know if this paint color is cool or warm, but it's a different story when it comes to lighting. And this is one of the main reasons why Whirly Gray is considered a chameleon. This is what Whirly Gray looks like in a south facing room or any room that receives a lot of natural lighting. Notice how it looks almost like a warm gray. You don't really see the cool undertones, but you will see the violet undertones. However, when it comes to a north facing room, Whirly Gray reacts completely different, especially if you have a lot of shadows. Notice how it looks darker. You see the violet undertones, and don't be surprised if you see either the blue or pink undertones in this paint color. So this is why Whirly Gray is considered a chameleon. Whirly Gray is a beautiful paint color. It's a chameleon, and when it comes time to pairing it with both your fixed and furnished items that you may have in your home, you need to make sure that you do it right because if you don't, it can end up being a costly mistake and I don't want that to happen to you. What do you think of Whirly Gray? Or have you painted your home a gray paint color and it didn't turn out the way that you hoped it would? Let me know in the comment section down below. If you need help on finding the perfect paint color and you want it professionally done, then feel free to check out the link in the description section down below. I show you how I can help you with any of my online packages, regardless where you live in North America. If you found value out of this video, put a like. Until then, I will see you in the next video.